He's an adorable three-year-old pet kangaroo named Carter, who lived in Tennessee with his family's other pet kangaroos. But his owner, Chris Lee, says a few days before Christmas, the unthinkable happened when his neighbor strangled Carter to death. This is the spot where you found Carter? Yes, this is, this is what Carter, this is it right here. Chris says he was out Christmas shopping when he received a phone call from his neighbor who lives back there and said that Carter had somehow gotten out of this kangaroo <laughs> enclosure and charged at the neighbor's wife. The wife cried as she called 911. It attacked me. I had to choke it with my hands because he wouldn't let go of me. I just stole their kangaroo. You had to want their kangaroo? No, so I fought for my life. Chris came home to find his beloved pet dead. What was your reaction when you realized what your neighbor had done? Just shocked. I'm still shocked today that it that it happened. You know, I'm still kind of sitting here just speechless. You know, I don't know what to do, what to think. Chris says the 65 pound roux was never a threat to the neighbors. But kangaroos are very strong and are known for their sparring matches with each other. They can become aggressive towards humans, too. Who could forget the guy who punched a kangaroo that attacked his dog? These are wild animals. They do not make good pets. Male kangaroos, when they feel threatened at all, will defend themselves aggressively. So they can become very aggressive and very dangerous because they're very powerful. Chris tells me he has no animosity towards his neighbor, but he is heartbroken his beloved kangaroo is gone. It's like family, it really is.